And also, so in the chat box, I'm going to share the link for our Telegram group where we receive more guidance, we share different transmissions and light codes, and um, we offer ourselves uh, energetical support as well as you did today with me. Thank you very much. Okay, so I, I've just shared, no, sorry, I shared, but just to, to Fabian. Uh, I'm going to share for everyone, yeah, uh, the link for, uh, for the Telegram group. Thank you very much. Um, I wouldn't take any notes for today. But if you really feel the need to do so, please, uh, please feel uh, fine with it. Just bring something to uh, write with and take your notes if, if it does resonate with you. I'm very curious to see where we are uh, located because we are going to probably most of us who join today we are going to open new portals with Sirius. And I'm very curious to see where we are located and how they are going to, to connect. And it's really wonderful to, to see people all over the world here. It's, there are people from Romania, uh, from America, from Norway, New Zealand, Germany, Holland. Um, Denmark, Mexico, England. And I think there is someone who, might, uh, who joins today for the first time. You might be from Thailand, but I'm not sure. If you wish to share with us, please, please do so. So please make yourself comfortable. I would need someone to help me with the admission of other people in the meeting in case that they, they wish to, to join after I start channeling. So if there is someone who wish to be my co-host, thank you very much, Annabelle. Okay, and because I already know that they are going to tell you about the Celestine or the Celestine crystal, I can show it to you for, for all of you to, to have an idea of how the crystal looks like. It's a very, um, it's a blue, very calming one. I really recommend it not only for opening uh, new portals with Sirius, and enhancing the frequencies from Sirius, but as well for um, bringing more peace into your life or having a, a better um, sleep pattern as well, um, for feeling a softer energy and as well for keeping your uh, connection with Sirius. So thank you very much. Thank you very much for the ones who already acquired the crystal. Okay, I don't have the next to me, I don't have any gold leaves, but I have shared on the group a link uh, with these gold flakes, which are uh, real gold, because you can easily find them, like the, the, the fake version of them. Uh, you, you'd find it on, on the group. Um, and yeah, let's see what, what, they, what they say, how they are going to, to guide us. Oh, 
Oh yes, and Fab Fab Fabian is from. She's from Canada. I'm sorry, I, I, I skipped it. Not intentionally. Thank you very much. So I need um, feedback from you. Please tell me if you can hear me well or not. Yes, thank you. And thank you very much, Annabelle, for taking a look once in a while at the screen to see if uh, someone else wishes to, to join. Daria just sent a message on the group that uh, she's not able to connect for now. So probably she's going to, to try more. Thank you. <clears throat> and Jenny, please, if you can mute uh, your uh, your microphone. Thank you very much. Sorry. Yeah, your actually your microphone's a little faint. It's a little faint. If you could make it a tiny bit louder, it'd be good. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. We greet you uh, all with love, we greet you with joy, we greet you with so much light. And as always, you're very welcome to step into our vibration just by opening your heart, taking a deep breath in, gently breathing out. You're all invited as well to step into the energy of the group to become aware of each and every member of the group. And whenever you wish to, to take one more deep breath in, to gently breathe out, bringing your attention in the center of your heart. And then to visualize yourself Mong with all the other members of this group forming a circle. And you're very much invited to enter the energy of the circle. And as you might uh, remember now, the circle is the sacred geometry that represents unity. Uh, represents the uh, God consciousness. Therefore, you're all invited to remember that we are all one. Stepping into the energy of the group, stepping into the energy of the circle, feeling the radiance of the entire circle, Sharing now that radiance even further in your own environment towards all your beloved ones and towards all those who live in the area where you live. Expanding that energy even further now towards Mother Earth, 
its animals and vegetation, its waters. Sending that energy of unity towards the entire humanity. Taking one more deep breath in, breathing out. Allowing yourself to deeply relax into our vibration, knowing that you're embodying this vibration right here and now, that there is nothing to do actively, but rather to allow the information and the energy that we send towards you to be fully embodied into your heart. Please take one more deep breath in, gently breathe out. We kindly invite today the Syrian Archangels of Light to join us in this transmission to bring their wisdom, their guidance, and their magical energy here. We thank you very much for your kind intentions of uh, collaborating with us, for your support into crystallizing the timeline that we have formed together and named it the new earth. We thank you very much for taking care that uh, this timeline is not only crystallized, but it's also, and uh, it is and it stays fully aligned with the vibration of the fifth dimension. We are eternally grateful to all those who uh, choose uh, to collaborate with us as light workers or frequency holders, uh, bringing your intentions together, um, uh, walking on the path that we um, offer to you and uh, committing to such missions of opening new portals on your planet. We also share with, with you today that as the vibration of Mother Earth shifts more and more, uh, the opportunities for uh, creating new energy vortexes on your planet increases. We are therefore very much welcome to um, learn how uh, to receive these frequencies and how to ground them on your planet. You're as well very much welcome to take the full advantage of creating such an energy vortex close to the space where you live. So you can actually shift your entire reality to the frequency of the blue beings or the frequency of Sirius as you name it. Thank you very much for uh, giving the opportunity to so many people to step into higher frequencies, uh, to um, create new realities which are not based on past experiences. We thank you so much for, um, uh, for making your uh, gifts available in such a wonderful way. Please take one more deep breath in. Please gently breathe out. Keeping your attention right into the space of your heart. And further, we kindly invite the Syrian Archangels of Light to bring in the blue sphere, sharing their frequency with you all through the energy of the blue bright sphere. And you're all very much welcome to bring your attention now at the level of your cosmic energy center, which is located above the top of your head. While the energy from the blue sphere is directed now in this energy center, opening it up, 
You can visualize it as a lotus flower with 1,000 petals, flower that opens its petals now entirely just above the top of your head, receiving the cosmic energy, receiving the blue codes, connecting once more with Sirius at deeper and deeper levels, bringing back the knowledge that you have acquired during Atlantis, during your Lemurian lives, during those lives that you lived in the ancient Egypt as well. Directing now the light from the blue sphere into the cosmic energy center, into the third eye, at the level of your throat, at the level of your heart, And you're very much invited to feel the blue sphere working now upon the space of your heart, opening deep and deeper, deeper and deeper layers of your heart chakra. Directing the blue light further into the solar plexus, shifting the energy there, uplifting it. Directing the same light in the sacral area and into your root chakra as well, taking a deep breath in here, visualizing once more and feeling the presence of the blue sphere of light. And then allowing the light to go along your spine, activating entirely the spine being now directed back into the crown chakra, back into the cosmic energy center. Please take one more deep breath in, gently breathe out, knowing that whenever you wish to call for the presence of the Syrian Archangels of Light, they will join you. They will make their presence felt into your life. Please have trust. Stay into that state of love and light. Connecting with the light beings in your own way. Inviting their healing, peaceful energy to shift the vibration of your system. And to align your consciousness with that of the fifth dimension. Knowing as well that whenever you wish to activate the blue sphere, what you actually do is to tap into a very specific frequency, which is a line uh, with Sirius, uh, providing uh, healing, providing support uh, for yourself and for all those uh, who are in need. As well, whenever you decide to uh, use the blue codes, you can easily imprint them into your ground, um, creating in this way um, different energy vortexes uh, that will activate um, uh, Mother Earth with that specific energy in that right, uh, in that uh, specific location that you have chosen. For this mission, we encourage you to really follow your intuition. It is mostly for you to be able to open your intuitive side more and more to gain more trust, mostly to connect with us and with the other cosmic families uh, in a, a deeper significant, at a deeper significant level. Um, you will easily notice that whenever you open your heart and you listen to your intuition, the right messages come to you exactly at the right time. Therefore, whenever you prepare yourself for choosing that place, that sacred place that will become a Syrian portal, please 
uh, take a few moments to bring your attention in the space of your heart to uh, ask your spirit guides, your guardian angel, and those ascended masters who guide you and protect you to show you the, the way. Observe the first image that comes into your mind or observe that first sound or message. And just be sure to start walking your path in your own way, enjoying your own journey. For this specific mission, we encourage you to uh, acquire the celestial crystals. And this time, instead of guiding you to uh, bury the crystal on the spot or to place the crystals and to lift them on the spot, uh, we kindly encourage you to uh, use them for activating the portal, but then to feel free to take them back home with you. We encourage you to choose a specific area on which you would like to activate it with blue codes. And then to um, choose the uh, borders of the area by placing your crystals in such a way in which you actually um, form a, a specific sacred geometry that you choose to for um, uh, limitate for um, the, the borders of your portal. Of course, it's always useful to take into consideration that um, those borders might actually spread further, that when it comes to you know, encoded frequencies, uh, one could never relate to them as uh, functioning uh, in a very strict environment. Uh, usually the frequency will be felt and can be felt further as well, it's just that its effect uh, is going to be diminished as one moves uh, further from the place. We kindly um, encourage you as well to acquire um, gold flakes uh, or to use um, a jewelry which is made out of coal that you can easily place uh, on the crystal of one on, of one of the crystals uh, once you um, decide for the ceremony to take place. We've, we've always encouraged you, mostly when it comes to uh, selenite, to use um, the gold flakes as they can, uh, as they can uh, easily be placed on your crystals. You're very much encouraged to create your own ceremony as your heart guides you, uh, but to stay connected with all the other light workers who wish to uh, participate to this mission, to bring your intentions and energies together by creating the ceremonies uh, at the same time. Please decide for uh, a date uh, and hour when all of you can actually go within, visit the spot that you have chosen, you can uh, place your crystals, You will be very much invited to enter a state of meditation in which you call for the Syrian Archangels of Light to guide you during the entire ceremony. Then you are guided to hold the intention of activating the land with the frequency of Sirius.
And as you hold your intention, you're as well guided to place the gold flakes of the, on the celestial crystals, knowing that the gold increases the frequency of the crystals which carry the energy of Sirius. Our encouragement is to remain in meditation for a while to feel the presence of all the light workers who hold the same intention as you do. If some of you in the group or if one of you in this group uh, is located um, near a certain uh, sacred spot that already carries the energy of Sirius, you're very much guided to create the ceremonial space right there and connect all the locations with the spot that you found. It might be a specific sacred place that you know that is already linked with Sirius. Please take a deep breath in, please gently breathe out. Whenever you close your ceremonies, you're very much welcome to share your gratitude with all the other light workers, uh, to share your gratitude as well with the Syrian Archangels of Light, inviting them to keep the earth activated with the energy of Sirius. You are as well invited to carry your uh, crystals back home with you, but to be sure to bring them back whenever you decide to uh, visit the place again. You're as well very much welcome to um, revisit your sacred spot as often as you can to uh, meditate there, uh, maybe even to create an altar for the blue beings uh, and to um, make it in this way your special place where you can easily step into the vibration of, uh, of the Syrian beings as well to stay very much aware that whenever other people will uh, visit or will walk on the land, they will be able to uh, easily step into that vibration and even to um, download it in their own system. Though we encourage you to choose your sacred spot by following uh, the instructions, the guidance of your own heart, um, and to notice if your heart uh, guides you to uh, choose such a, a spot, which is uh, commonly visited by other people, or to actually choose a location which is secluded, uh, and that will be uh, visited mostly by you. Please take one more deep breath in, please gently breathe out. We also share with you that uh, the celestine or the celestine crystals do not need to be uh, cleansed in any way. Uh, they love uh, the energy of the moon, therefore you're very much guided to place them under the moon. Uh, please do not place your crystals in full sun or in the water. We are though very much encouraged to uh, place a few drops of water on your crystals. Or even if you decide to actually take them with you in the water, to know that uh, the celestial crystal loves water, it's just that it easily disintegrates uh, whenever you, uh, you will uh, place it in, uh, in, uh, in the water. Please take one more uh, deep uh, breath in, please gently breathe out. Okay, 
is take into your consideration that whenever you open such a new portal, you might uh, attract uh, different interdimensional beings. Be sure to honor those uh, who enter your portal. Be sure as well to open your heart to their presence uh, and to uh, invite their presence in, uh, in your own life. Uh, to know that this is a great opportunity, not only for uh, bringing the Syrian energy back on your planet, but as well to invite all those beings who highly uh, relate with the vibration of Sirius to step through the portal. We thank you so much for bringing your hearts together, for bringing your energies together uh, for this mission to take place. Thank you for your radiance, for all of your kind intention and the wonderful way in which you choose to manifest them. We thank you for having trust and um, for uh, bringing uh, your intentions together. Please take one more deep breath in, please gently breathe out while we invite the Syrian Archangels of Light bring the presence of the blue sphere once more. And this time you're very much invited to visualize it just in the center of your heart. Observing how your heart chakra merges now with the blue color, with the blue healing energy. opening up its deeper and deeper layers. Activating as well that wisdom that you have acquired during your lifetimes in Atlantis, Lemuria, and the ancient Egypt. Inviting this knowledge, this wisdom to come back on the surface of your consciousness during your sleep time, in your dreams, during your meditations. Or whenever you wish to recall certain events, so you can actually grow out of them and share that wisdom further. We thank you all for your wonderful presence here today. We thank you for keeping your hearts widely open. We love you. We love you. We love you. So thank you very much for being here today. Once more, I show you the celestial crystal. I'm very happy that uh, so many of you will actually join this mission. I also announce you that we have decided uh, for 13th of October, as the date when we are going to activate the portals. We have uh, decided, I'm not sure if we have decided the time, actually it was somewhere in between three and the evening time, um, UK time. So we are going to, to further uh, decide the time on the group. Thank you very much for acquiring uh, the crystals. You don't need to energize them. 
all that you need to do, and we are going to be there anyway together, is to call for the presence of the Syrian Archangels of Light and to invite them to actually imprint their frequencies in the sacred land that you, that you will choose. So that's, that's all that you have to do, and you're very much invited to, to have trust and to know that um, everything will go just wonderful. I'm going to join you in this mission. So we'll uh, make myself sure that everything is just perfect and that uh, each and every each and every land gets to to uh, receive the the energy vortex. If there is any way in which you could visit the spot before and share some pictures on the group that we have, that would be very useful. So thank you very much. If you decide to visit the spot, to take a few pictures and to share them on the group, then we will have a bit of an idea where we are located and how we, uh, we form this beautiful energy of the group for activating the new portals with Sirius. They have also shared with you today that if there is anyone who lives close to a place which is very much already activated with this energy to share it um, in, in the group so we can know. And while they were saying so, it came to me that um, the uh, very nice uh, channeler that we, that me and Lindsay met um, in uh, England a few, a few weeks ago, she lives just, she lives just there at Avebury and at Avebury, there is an old stone, stone which is actually imprinted with the energy of Sirius. So probably I will, I will kindly invite her again to participate in this mission as well and to uh, open the portal there or to support the entire energy of the group through the portal, which is already there. It's a very magical place. Uh, there are many stones at Avebury, and I remember when I uh, we had like a meditation night for the full moon with her there, and she placed her her hand on that specific stone, and she asked me, "What is the energy here? What what is the um, the place with which the stone is connected?" And I said, like not in even a few seconds, I said, "Sirius," and she said, "Yeah, this is exactly the the energy of Sirius." So it's a very powerful one, a very uh, recognizable one, I would say. And I really hope that she will accept it and we will have a bit of even more support during this mission. I'm very much sure that it will go up perfectly. It's not the first time when I, when I do it. I've opened a portal with, uh, with Sirius um, in the Canary Islands in La Palma. And they have also guided me to go there as often as I can to meditate on the spot, to recreate the ceremonial space uh, at least once per year. And at this time, after a few years, the energy there is just amazing. It's just amazing. It's, it's um, in one of the, the, the place, it's in one of the oldest uh, subtropical uh, forests in Europe. And it's not a visited place. It's really in the middle of nowhere, but it's such an incredible one. And, and every year I could, I could feel the energy being stronger and stronger. And that is also a place which is very much connected with Atlantis. So it was just lovely to, to do it there. And um, now I can't wait to, to open a new portal closer to my house, most probably somewhere in the forest here. And I can't wait to connect with you and to, uh, to feel how we are going to, to actually to do it together and to connect the portals. So thank you very much. It's, it's really, really wonderful. I'm really grateful. And we are going to share more information on the group. Please um, uh, join us on Telegram if you're not there yet. And I hope we are going to decide for a good time when the ceremony to happen on 13th of, of October. So thank you. Thank you very much for um, your presence here today. Thank you very much for all of your kind intentions. 
Thank you very much uh, once again for your donations. I'm really grateful. And I hope to see you soon again. Uh, we are going to have the meditation on Monday at 6 p.m. UK. Please feel free to join us. And I wish you a very relaxing, very peaceful weekend. And thank you very much to you all who sent me uh, energy today. And I'm, I'm really grateful. Thank you. Hope to see you soon. Goodbye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Take Bye. care. Bye. Please feel free to ask for the recording. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Lots of love. Lots of love. Thank you.